Hello and welcome to Williams Dog Training Company. We're here today with Barry and Joy. And what we're going to be demonstrating for you today on video is Joy's ability to understand and respond to her obedience commands, the corrections and the motivations we give the dogs while we're working with them, and the training equipment we're using. Barry's using a regular six foot web training leash and he'll keep the bulk of that leash folded neatly in his right hand, which leaves the left hand free to give the correction. The correction if needed is just a tug and release on the training collar, which is the second piece of equipment that we're using. Joy's been fitted with her very own personal training collar and we'll go over how to use that during your one-on-one -on -one training session. You'll notice that Joy is seated nicely on Barry's left, which is where all of our obedience training is done. The first command we'll demonstrate for you today is healing. Healing is proper walking on a leash and the command is Joy Heal. You'll notice that Joy has been trained to walk very nicely on your left at your pace, so there should be no lagging behind or pulling forward, and incorporated into the heel exercise is an automatic sit. So anytime Joy stops, or excuse me, anytime you stop, Joy should sit nicely on your left, waiting for her next command. A very nice automatic sit. The next command we'll show you is the stay command. The stay is a hand and a voice command. You're gonna use the open flat of your left palm and the one word firm command to stay. Stay. When you first start working on this command, you wanna make her sit stays relatively short but build up her ability to stay in this position for longer periods of time. Now she did go into the down, so Barry's gonna heal her back and repeat the command. It's always important to follow through when you do give Joy a command. Stay. When Barry returns back to Joy, he's going to walk all the way around her, and Joy should remain seated until she receives praise or another command. Very nicely done. We'll run through the heel, the sit, and the stay again for you. It's important that when you're working, Joy through her commands, that you praise her, keep her motivated, interested in the training. This is a great mental exercise for her, and should be pleasurable for both of you. This time, instead of returning back to Joy, Barry will demonstrate the recall or the come on command. Joy, come. The command is Joy come, and she's been trained to come in and sit nicely right in front of you. You should coax her in if she doesn't come all the way in. And then we have an exercise called the finish, and she will heel around the back and back to heel position. Very good job. We'll show that to you again. Stay. She, she comes in, sits nicely right in front, and then she'll go back to heel position. Very good job. The next command we're going to demonstrate is the down command. You're going to use the open flat of your left palm straight down towards the ground and the one word firm command to down. Down. As with the sit stay, you want to make your down stays relatively short in the beginning, but build up her ability to hold this command for longer periods of time. This really helps develop her self control. When Barry returns back, he's going to walk all the way around, and Joy should remain lying down until she receives praise or another command. Very nicely done. We're going to heal her out of that, and we're going to show you the down from the heel position again. These are all exercises that you can practice right in your home, and that way Joy learns her manners within the home. This time Barry will call her in. Joy, come, come girl. She comes in, sits in front of Barry, very good job, and then back to heel position. The last command that we'll demonstrate is down from a distance. We'll give her a minute to scratch. <laughs> and we're gonna leave her in a sit stay. She's got a little itch. <laughs> it's important that you incorporate all of these commands into your daily life, but we also recommend that you set aside about 10 minutes a day 
to run through the commands in a formal session such as this video. This time Barry is going to give her the down command from the end of the training leash and demonstrate down from a distance. Down. Very down. good job. These are all the formal obedience commands that Julie has learned while she's been at school with us. She's been a pleasure to train. We've really enjoyed having her here at the school. Please keep us posted on how she's doing for you back at home. And we thank you so much for choosing Williams Dog Training Company as your personal dog trainers.